you are renting dynamic treatment mattresses today, you could start saving money tomorrow while also providing your residents a trusted sleep service used by thousands of caregivers across the country. Direct Supply Panacea mattresses offer optional side bolsters that help reduce the risk of falls from bed and entrapment. And they can be customized to accommodate bariatric residents as well as fit non-standard length and width beds. Plus, they are quick to set up and easy to maintain, so there's no reason to continue paying high rental rates to an outside party. This short video will show you exactly how to set up and maintain your own dynamic mattresses so you can start saving money in your community today. First, place the mattress on the bed frame with the hoses exiting at the foot end of the bed. Then, secure the mattress to the bed deck. Be sure to only attach the straps to the parts of the bed that articulate, not to any stationary parts of the bed frame. Hang the control unit on the end of the bed or place on a stable horizontal surface. Connect the mattress to the control unit by pushing the connector into the air ports located on the side of the pump until you hear it click securely into place. Ensure the air lines are not kinked or twisted. For the Panacea APL and the Panacea Advance, set the firmness level to the lowest setting and allow the mattress to fully inflate. For the Panacea Air Max, Element, and Pro, Set the firmness to the highest setting and allow the mattress to fully inflate. Depending on the model, this will take between 1 and 40 minutes. With the resident on the mattress, adjust firmness on the control unit as needed to achieve resident comfort, support, and appropriate immersion. When adjusting the pressure on the Panacea Air Element and Air Pro, first, set the unit to the resident's weight. You'll want to verify this is the most suitable setting for your resident by using the hand check method. For the Air Element controls, turning the knob clockwise will increase the pressure, while counterclockwise will decrease it. For the Air Pro, the plus and minus buttons can be used to adjust firmness. A common method for determining a suitable inflation level is to slide one hand into the mattress between the air cells beneath the resident's buttocks, keeping your hand in an upright position similar to if you were going to shake hands with someone. A space of one to one and a half inches between the caregiver's hand and the resident's body is typically acceptable. And please keep in mind that multiple layering of linens or under pads beneath a resident can negatively affect the therapeutic performance and should be avoided unless recommended by a caregiver. In the event of low pressure, an audio and or visual alarm will sound. The air filter for the control unit should be checked routinely for signs of dirt or contamination. For most models, you will replace a dirty filter with a new filter. For the Panacea Air Max model, the filter can be rinsed and reused. Please keep in mind the frequency of replacing depends on the air quality. Mattresses should be cleaned regularly and always before use by a new resident. The mattress zipper must not be opened during cleaning for infection control. Organic cleaner or soapy water should be used first.
If a stubborn stain remains, advance to one of these which will not cause fabric breakdown. Quartinary wipe down or a pre-diluted 8-10% bleach and water wipe down. After cleaning, wipe down the cover with clean water using a sponge or cloth. Always follow standard institutional wipe down and infection control procedures. And also remember, mattress cover laundering is not recommended. For more information on Direct Supply Panacea mattresses, visit directsupply.com or call 1-800-634-7328.